We are under the lights this evening as we get you set for another edition of Baseball on the Show. A good matchup here for you tonight between the San Diego Padres and the San Francisco Giants. Standing in, Juan Ligaris. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. The 2 1. No touchdown. Strike taken as that one catches the outer part of the plate. Temperature was in the 70s earlier today, but 59 at game time tonight. Hit high in the air down the right field line. In there, a base hit. He's around first, heading for two. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. The first baseman, Eric. Standing in now, Eric Hosmer. Softly to the right side, should get the runner to third. Scooped up, and the off-balance throw gets him. Nice play for the out. Digging in now for That's San Diego. Good. Tommy so Pham trying to pick up that Tommy first in. run in this one. Oh. Lead-off man at third with one away. A swing and a ground ball to third. But a foul ball, one and two now. Working for the punch out and the offering. Line drive to left. Catch is made. Here comes the runner from third. Oh, but it's offline, so the run will score. And that'll bring up Fernando Tatis Jr. And he comes Fernando in as a player to watch out for, hitting well over 300 on the season. Now a good pitch around the knees, but it doesn't quite catch the bottom of the zone. Nip the corner, two and two. The pitch. Swing and a miss. He struck him out with a two-seamer, and the inning is over. Stepping in, Wilmer Flores. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. His eyes lit up on that one above the zone, but he comes up empty. Hey, that two-seam fastball is going to be the be-all, end-all of this game right here. Who's going to execute? Is the pitcher going to be able to keep going to that well, or is the offense going to be able to make an adjustment and hit that ball in the gap? Got him to miss the breaking ball there. Wilmer Flores is retired for the first out here in the bottom half of the first. And just never could commit to the swing there, but he went around, and it's even now at 2-2. Two and two. Pulled toward right center field. Myers is under it. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Here's the right fielder, Hunter Pence. Pair of hits in five trips to the plate in yesterday's game. He stays alive, still two and two. Two out, nobody on. Shin high fastball that time, ball three. Mike Yastrzemski would be next if they can keep this inning alive. Ripped down the first base line. Fielded cleanly by Hosmer, and he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. And in steps Manny Machado. He drove in the other of the two runs in that game yesterday. Not what he wanted to do there with the slider as it misses well above the zone. He's fallen behind now, three and one. This is where you cash your checks right here. Three one, you're one of the best hitters in the game. You live for situations like this. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. So here's Will Myers, and he comes in as a player to watch out for, hitting well over 300 on the season. Here now the 2-2. Drives it out to deep right center field. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. 
So bases are empty here with two gone. And that'll bring up the power hitting second baseman Brian Dozier. One and two now as that one's fouled off. There's a swing and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. At the wall he leaps and makes a spectacular catch. And with it that'll end the inning. Next to bat for the Giants, Mike Yastrzemski. He had a homer in the ball game yesterday afternoon. Line drive to left. And the Giants are officially into the hit column. There's their first base hit. Batting fifth, the third baseman, Pablo. Into the box now, Pablo Sandoval. Back up the middle. And that's through for a hit. Stepping in now, Alex Dickerson. Got a piece, it's two and two. Slowly hit to first. I don't think they can get two. One there. Return throw is in time. And what do you know? They do get the double play. Here's the first baseman, Brandon Bell. As he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. The set and the 1-1. One -one. Now a change up, but it misses just a little below the zone. Fouled away. Here's the two and two. In the dirt and block behind the plate. But it won't skip away far enough for the runner to advance. Ready with the payoff pitch. Swing and a miss. Blew the fastball right by him and the inning is over. Next to the plate for the Padres, Francisco Mejia, as we are all set to begin the third inning in this one. Split fingered pitch that's by him for strike two. Hit sharply on the ground. Oh, and he has some trouble with it. No, he stays. To the plate now, Chris Paddock. Now a bunt attempt here. And Posey will get the out at first, but the sacrifice works as planned. Here's Juan Ligares. Next to the Padres, the cover fielder, Juan Ligares. Here now the 2 2. It's a fastball that misses. On deck, there's Eric Hosmer. Line toward right center. And he won't get it as that's down for a base hit. And they're not going to get him as he's in there to score. Now that the first base, Eric Hosmer. Into the box, Eric Hosmer. Strike called, now the throw down. Bounces, but he's out. Nice play there to pick the throw and put the tag on quickly. Ready to deliver the one and two. Popped him up. Sandoval is there for it. And the inning is over. So in now for San Francisco, Buster Posey. And he comes in as a player to watch out for, hitting well over 300 on the season. Hey, we're still in the early stages of this one. They're only down by a couple of runs. But it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. A swing and a miss on a ball way out of the zone, and there's one away. And now the Giants pitcher, Kevin Gossman. Ready with the 1-1 pitch. 
Bases are empty, one man out. Off speed pitch in the dirt as he takes it for a ball. Line toward the alley in left center. And the pitcher's got himself a base hit. Now back, second baseman, Wilmer. At the plate now, Wilmer Flores heading out towards shallow right. And that'll get down for a base hit. Throw into third. But too late, and he's safe at third. In now, Brandon Crawford. Oh, and this is swung on and missed. Four strikeouts already, and that's out number two. Now to the plate, Hunter Pence. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Waved at and missed for the third out. Not much of a chance at hitting that one, and the inning is over. Digging in for his second at bat, Tommy Pham. He hit a sack fly earlier. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. He takes the turn and heads for second. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. Now back. Fernando Standing in now, Fernando Tatis Jr. A little behind on that swing, and now he'll try to shorten up maybe and protect the plate. Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. On a line, that's a base hit in the left field. Long throw to the plate. Ah, but the throw is well up the line, and he scores easily. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. The third base, number 13. Manny. Into the box Machado. now, Manny Machado. Oh. And now a fastball, but he's able to hold off on it, and it's 2-1 and one now. Fastball just inside. This is a spot you'd like to be in as a good hitter. Runners in scoring position and count leverage in your favor. Fastball taken, but that gets the zone for a strike. A line that's a base hit the throw home and they're not going to get him he's in there at the plate the right fielder number four yeah. to the plate now Will Myers Myers takes and this winds up missing ball four ready for another chance Brian Dozier so far 0 for 1 with a fly out the 1-1 one, one. Misses down below the knee. Hey, time to start making some quality pitches. He finds himself in a tough spot behind an account with guys on base. The 2-2. Two -two. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. Dickerson on his horse. Oh, and a great diving catch for the first down. And they won't get him at third as they've moved runners to the corners now with just one away. So first and third with one away. And that'll bring in the catcher, Francisco Mejia. And there's ball two now. His pitch count is getting up there in the inning now. He needs to get this frame over with sooner than later, so forcing contact and getting the defense involved is probably the best thing he can do. Here now the 2-2. Four runs, six hits. No errors in the ballgame for the Padres. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Catch is made deep in the alley, and here comes the runner from third. And the run is in to score from third. Now a 5-0 lead. Next to hit will be the pitcher, Chris Paddock. He successfully laid down a sack bunt in his last plate appearance. And not easy to do in today's game. High velocity, exploding breaking stuff. He executed that sack bunt perfectly.
in the air down the line in left. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And next to bat will be the outfielder, Mike Yastrzemski. Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on, but you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle, and one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. And it's fouled away. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. There's the panda on deck. He'll bat next. And that misses for ball four. It's a leadoff walk that starts the bottom of the fourth. Riding in once again, Pablo Sandoval. One for one after a single his first time up. Hit back toward the mound. A step on the bag for one. On to first, and it's a double play. The second they've hit into in these first four innings. And there are two away now. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Alex Dickerson. The 2-1 home. Changeup taken for ball three, well below the zone. Brandon Belt would be next if they can keep this inning alive. Count still full, three and two. No runs, four hits, and no errors on the giant ledger to this point. Now a fastball swung on and missed, and that is out number three. Sam Coonrod, a six foot two inch right hander, jogs in to take over on the mound. Number 65. All ready to go in the top of the fifth. And digging in is the outfielder, Juan Ligaris. Here's the one and one pitch. Grounded back up the middle. And a base hit, so early trouble to lead off the inning. Now that the first base. Stepping in now, Eric Hosmer. Hosmer's able to lay off, so he'll move to first on the free pass. Now back. So digging in now, Tommy Pham. Tommy. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. Tommy couldn't pull that one back as he clearly broke the plane to the plate, and that'll be ruled a strike. And this is pulled foul as he was way out in front there. And another foul ball. Lagares on second. Hosmer on at first with nobody out. Another one sent foul. Pitch is mishandled behind the plate and it bounces away. So now two men in scoring position. There's a base hit on the line. And the run is in to score from second. It's 7 0. Next to the Padres, the shortstop. So now to the plate, Fernando Tatis Jr. Pitch outside. The throw is not going to get him as he swipes second. He's set and the 2 1 pitch. Oh, right back to him on the mound. And an unproductive at bat that time as the runner holds it second with one away now. Here's Manny Machado now. One for two on his line so far in the game. Machado. Now a spin and a throw back to second, and the runner back safely. And the 2 1. And he fouls this one off. Runner at second here with one man out. And that misses, so it's a full count, three and two. 
for the guy on the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this A.B. hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. And they'll have to chase it down out around the 382 sign. As he arrives at second without a play, as also on the play, a run oh, comes field. across to score. Danny Jimenez gets the call to pitch here, and he'll try to sort this mess out. He's going to try to at least eat a couple of innings for his guys. At the plate, Will Myers. Swing and a miss out in front of a changeup. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Here's Brian Dozier now. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. Brian Dozier. And he strikes him out here, so he's able to stop the bleeding a bit as the side is retired. Set now for the bottom of the fifth, and next to bat will be the first baseman, Brandon Belt. This one doesn't look good so far. Down by a boatload as we enter the middle innings. It's about time they get something going, and the last thing you want to do is fall behind where you have to score a bunch in the eighth and ninth inning. Line to shortstop, and there's one away. One away now. Here's the catcher, Buster Posey. The pitch. And he lays off it to even the count two and two. Everything this guy throws moves. And that two-seamer has a mind of its own. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time. Out number two. Donovan Solano will get the call to pinch hit here as we'll see what he can do with two out and the base is empty. Bases are empty here with two men out. Swung on and missed. One and two now. Hey, offense needs to check itself right here. They need to make this starter a little bit more uncomfortable. One strike away from five shutout innings. Again, another foul ball. Here's another one, two. Down the third baseline. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at one and two. Can't find the zone there as he lays off the breaking ball. Hey, this guy's a hard guy to put away. He's fouling off some tough pitches. 2-2 two -two count, and he just seems to keep hanging right in there. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Pham is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. John Del Gustave gets the call to pitch here, and he'll try to sort this mess out. He's going to try to at least eat a couple of innings for his guys. Digging in once again, Francisco Mejia. It was an RBI sack fly for him last time through. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. Fouled off. And he takes ball three, so it's a full count now. It's been a great job so far by the eight-hole hitter. If he finds a way to get on base, this could spell for a huge inning. Now a ball popped up. But room in foul ground for the catcher, Posey. And he'll stay with it here as he puts the squeeze on it for route number one. So here now is the pitcher, Chris Paddock, getting the hit for himself here, largely due to the big cushion he's got to work with. And the Padres pitcher behind with a one and two count. And here's a ball lifted back toward the stands in right, so we'll try it again at one and two. And the pitch. Right side, but it's going to be a foul ball. The one two. Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. Hey, that fastball caught too much of the plate on an 0 2 count. 
The one two. Just a bit low. Tough call, but it's two and two. These last two guys are making him work quite a bit out there. Both have been long at bats, and all in all, he's had to make 13 throws just to them so far. Swing and a liner. Got him swinging. Chased it well out of the zone, and there are two gone. The batter. So the lineup flips over and digging in Juan Ligares. He's got three hits, including a double to this point. Now the one and one pitch. Popped him up. And the Panda will put this one away. Inning over. And now back to the leadoff spot in the Giants lineup. Stepping forward, Wilmer Flores. He's one for two in the ballgame. And they'll go off speed here as this pitch misses. It's two and one. Strike two called, and it's even at two. Two balls, two strikes, a crucial count for both pitcher and hitter. So, Dan, what was your approach on the mound in that count? Do you still pitch for the strikeout here? Action pitch right here, 2-2. Two, two. The last thing you want to do is to fall behind the count 3-2. He froze him on the breaking ball that time. Wilmer Flores is dealt with for the first out in the bottom of the inning. A swing and a miss for out number two and a ball he had no chance of making contact with. A 1-1. Now a rocket deep down the line in left. And that'll get down out there for extra bases. And he will pull into second with a two-out double. Standing in now, Mike Yastrzemski. Nipped the corner, two and two. And he holds off on the breaking ball, so the count runs full. Now on three and two as a pitcher, you've got to go with the pitch that you feel most comfortable throwing with. Here's a fly ball well hit. Left fielder is on the move. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. Eric Hosmer to the plate now. 0 for 2 for him to this point. Yeah, and this is the guy for me. I, I, I think this is the guy in the clubhouse that the guys truly gravitate towards. The total package of Eric Hosmer's game is really special. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Dickerson is in his tracks now. One gone. Now, now batting, Tommy Pham. He doubled oh, earlier and carries a two-for-two two line into this appearance. And he just misses inside with the fastball there. And got him to go down after that one, and it's two and two. Hey, I love the mindset of this pitcher right here. Try and dominate and execute a fastball in, and then get the guy sitting inside trying to be quick to everything, and then pull the string a little bit on a nasty changeup. And that's low ball four. And it'll be the cleanup spot for the Padres. Fernando Tatis Jr. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Yeah, Matty, expect this pitcher to try and get the same result as his last at bat right here. The double play is in order. Anything on the ground, the way this defense is, they could certainly roll too. In the dirt here. No advance here, but it's three and one now. Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. Hit fairly well out towards straightaway center. Dickerson's under it. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Digging in to try it again. Manny Machado, two for three with a double on his line so far. Now the one-and-one one pitch. 
two out with the man at first. Now a fastball, but that's easy to lay off, and it's back to even at two and two. And a fastball swung on and missed, and the side is retired. For the traditional seventh-inning Bottom of the inning now, and up next, former World Series MVP Pablo Sandoval. Starting to run out of time. They haven't been able to score any runs as we're moving late into this one. A perfect time for this leadoff guy to try to get on base and ignite a rally. Line toward the gap in left center. And this will find the gap for Sandoval. Should be extra bases. Not in time, and he's in there with a double. Andres Munoz comes on now and he'll take over with nobody out in inning number seven. Your attention please. Now pitching for San Diego. Number 52. Andres Munoz. At the plate now. Alex Dickerson. Fastball taken inside for a ball. Two and one now. This is popped up. Machado is calling for it. He's got it one away. Ready once again, Brandon Belt. He lined out in his last trip, so looking for better fortunes here. Yeah, Matty, but as he walks to the plate right here, he feels good building off that last A.B. He hit that ball on the screws. Dozier with a great stop. And that's an incredible effort to get the second out of the inning. Into the box now, Buster Posey, runner in scoring position with Sugan. The 1 1 home is taken for strike two. Two outs here with the runner at third. Two balls and two strikes to the Giants catcher. The 2 2. Swing and he pops him up, but this will land untouched. Come on, Giants. Here's another 2 2. Got him, and he goes down on strikes for the third time. Stepping up now, Will Myers in his career versus this pitcher. Not a big sample size, 0 for 1. Fouled away. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one two. Hit hard to the right side. But foul. Well, somebody's sitting off speed right here. Only way he was laid on that heater is he was expecting another changeup. Line drive base hit. With that, the inning opens with the Padres getting their leadoff man on base. The batter number nine, second baseman, Brian. Into the box Dozier. now, Brian Dozier. And a change up here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. Hit sharply on the ground. Oh, in trouble for Sandoval. There's one, but they won't get two as he beats the relay to first. At the plate, Francisco Mejia. He'll swing it from the left side right here. This is somewhat of a cause for concern. This guy needs to hit better left-handed against right-handed pitching. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. It's a two-and-two two count to the Padres catcher. Hey, that's the modern game right now. North-south. Elevate that high fastball and bury stuff in the dirt. Completely different from the east-west we came up playing. Left fielder is on the move. He gets there, and that's the second out. Settling in now, Andres Munoz. And he's getting his first Andres plate appearance here in the eighth Munoz. after entering off the bench just a little bit ago. Up high, two and one now. 
You certainly know he's not trying to work around the pitcher. But sometimes the hardest thing to do is to throw a strike to a guy that you know won't swing the bat. A runner on first with two away. Line but speared on a hop. Belt will take this one himself, and that ends the inning. Mauricio Dubon will try and get his club back into it here as he'll pinch Number hit to one. lead off the home half Mauricio of the eighth. Dubon. Well behind that fastball, it's a swinging strike. I try and tell people all the time, you're facing 90 to 92, 94. You can still see seams. It starts getting above 94. It starts to blur itself a little bit. You start pitching where this guy's at, you're seeing nothing. You're seeing oh, vapor. Gone. One gone here in the Giants Wilmer. half of the eighth. And up next, Wilmer. the utility man, Wilmer Flores. The three and one pitch. Hit the other way out toward right field. Myers is under it. He hauls it in without any trouble. And there are two away. Brandon Crawford digging in next. 0 for 3 with a couple of strikeouts for him to this point in the ballgame. Ready with the 1 and 1. Check swing. No swing, says the home plate umpire. Ball 2. I think when a team starts struggling, certainly offensively, it's just guys try and play above their pay grade. Know who the best players are in the lineup and try and get on base to set them up. Ligares is under it. And that retires the side. Yeah. Reyes Maranta comes on to pitch now, hoping for better results than the other arms that they've run out there in this one. All set to start the ninth in this one, and that'll bring forth the veteran outfielder, Juan Ligares. Three one. Aye. Four count. Three and two. Aye. Full count still. Belt is over to take a look and foul. Another full count pitch home. And this pitch misses here. It's ball four, and they've got a leadoff base runner aboard to start the ninth. Now batting. The first now at the plate, Eric Hosmer. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Ready with the 1-1 pitch. Ah, gets him to swing at a pitch down and out of the zone, one and two. Now a chopper to first might only get one. Fielded cleanly to Crawford for one. The relay back to the pitcher covering in time to double him up. So striding forward now, Tommy Pham. Two hits in two trips for him thus far. A one and one count. Here's the pitch. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. When the guy on the mound has complete command of his off speed, especially his changeup, sometimes as a hitter you just have to give up pull side to stay on it. Two balls and two strikes now. The 2-2. Two -two. Softly hit to short. He's got it. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. So stepping in, Hunter Pence. He doubled his last time through. And he's got to build off that last A.B. He battled. Usually when you battle, you get in that swing mode. A lot of pitches, you'll swing at the rosin bag. I love the fact that he was able to work a double in, last at bat. Let's see if we get more of the same right here. When the pitcher on the mound's establishing this kind of heater, you got to come off everything else and find a way to get that bat head in the zone. Count full, three balls and two strikes. Now the three and two pitch. Line hard. But this is a foul ball. Giants. 
The next 3 2. Swing and a miss, and that'll get a groan from the home supporters here. One away. Now the Giants' number four batter, Mike Yastrzemski, a hit in two official trips to the plate to this point in the ballgame. Oh, and he struck him out as well, so he's carving right through the heart of this lineup as there are two away now. Giants down to their final out now. And standing in now, the versatile Pablo Sandoval. And this is swung on and missed, so now they find themselves down to their final strike tonight. Boy, he looks strong out there on the mound this inning. He's got a chance to punch out this. And he gets strike three called to end it here. And with that, this one is over. Yeah, and in this game, you always try to find a way to be hopeful. They win the first game of a new month and are now looking to keep it rolling the rest of the way. An 8 nothing shutout this evening. San Diego jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Chris Paddock earns his eighth victory of the season. Kevin Gossman was only able to work four innings as he takes the loss. Andres Munoz takes the rare three-inning save, his first of the year. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and Heidi Watney, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter, at MLB The Show. The final line score for our ball game tonight for the victorious San Diego Padres. Eight runs, ten hits, no errors. They left four men on base. For the Giants, no runs, six hits, no errors. They left five men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and one minute. Thank you for joining us here this evening. We remind you to please drive home safely.